A nine-year-old in Brooklyn is grazed in the head by a bullet while sitting on a park bench. This comes as cops across the country tonight are trying to make inroads in their communities to promote peace and stop gun violence. Jim Dolan is covering that angle, but we begin with Josh Honiger and the gun insanity in Brooklyn. There was a familiar sound at the Seth Lowe houses in Brownsville this evening. The din of two-way radios brandished by an army of police. Here again, like clockwork. This happens all the time. It's every day, it's like, it doesn't end. It's like a war against ourselves. Raven Washington didn't even know why the cops were here this time. To her, it no longer even matters. Turns out a nine-year-old girl sitting with her grandmother on a bench was grazed in the head with a BB pellet, likely fired from an upstairs window. These days, the fact that it wasn't a real gun passes for good news. It's too much. Like, this literally is our neighborhood where we're supposed to come and we're supposed to feel safe in, and we're not having that anymore. Cops searched the buildings but found no shooter, and in the end, this wound up being just a normal night in this neighborhood of Brownsville. Except this night is not normal. It's National Night Out. When communities across the country and throughout Brooklyn gather to stop this madness. See that? That's the button right there. The mayor was surrounded at the annual National Night Out Against Crime event in East New York with people who want him, need him to make a difference. I think he's doing, he's trying, he's trying. You know, it, it's a big struggle, a big push. And I see he's putting out the police out there, he's putting out resources out there to deal with the situation. And both murders and shooting incidents are down this year over last, but many other crime categories are more troubling. Robbery and felony assault are both up significantly. The crime numbers are perhaps a mixed bag, but the mayor who follows them closely, whose political career may well depend on how they go, says he sees in them hope. I know what 2,000 homicide a year looked like. We turn it around then, we're going to turn it around again. They're believing again. They know their mayor is one of them. The whole point of National Night Out is to cultivate cooperation between people in high crime neighborhoods and the police. Tonight, some of the children wore badges to show support, and the mayor urged them to follow his own path into the NYPD. We're going to encourage them to become police officers. We're going to encourage them to become sergeants, lieutenant, captains, and inspectors. Because if you know the type of police you want, then raise them from the community to be in the community, to police in the community, because that's what I did. 